Hey guys, what's up? I'm here for uh, episode 2 of my rebuilding series, and um, I've been fishing Monkfish ever since I, uh, I started exporting my last one. That's actually what I came up with, and um, I came up with this as I started exporting it, so I've been doing this ever since. Don't really have a whole lot to prove it, because I did go and eat dinner and do some other stuff. But um, there's 73 fishing. I figured I'm going to do this to a level, and then I'm going to go and do some dungeoneering. Because some of my friends want to do that, so hopefully I get 75 tonight, that's the goal, but I highly doubt that's going to happen, because that is, let's see here, that is 300k XP away, and that's not going to happen, I'm being realistic here, I know for a fact that I'm getting 72 right now, just because I'm only 50k off it, but then from 72 to 75 is going to be a pain in the butt, but anyways... Um, as far as this episode of Road to Rebuilding, I'm not even going to call this episode 2 actually, I'm just going to call this a bonus clip, because all I did was fish mock fish, um, that made me 77k, which should be enough to buy a set of rune, combined with the 6k I have in here, um, there's really nothing else that I have in here that's worth any value, as far as combat goes, this is what I'm using at the moment. Um, I'm, the d going to be swapped out for rune for any melee armor that I need once I get the rune. And then after I buy the rune, the plan of action is going to be buy a glory, dragon boots, a ring of wealth, and then a whip. And then once I get a whip, I could sell this. And then as far as the cape goes, I'm going to be getting a fire cape hopefully soon. Um, depends on if I can get enough money for like brews and everything, but you know, that's whatever. Um, and so now I actually died, when I died earlier in the first episode, I lost my, uh, my ring of kinship because I accidentally took that there instead of my uh, instead of my uh, attack cartel or whatever the other rings called the uh, the um, Tizar ring that you get for the elder guild in quest so instead I'm gonna just go and get mine back real quickly and um I guess that's it for this video sorry that it was only like a really really short video but I just wanted to let you guys know that I've been fishing. I just got 73 fishing and that I'm going for a chaotic at the moment. That's really my goal. Um, I'm hoping that I can get one before uh, June 15th. So halfway between or halfway through the month of June is when I'm hoping to have my first chaotic. And then my second one by the end of June. Um, I'm also going to be going for a lot of levels soon. Because I've been talking to a few people and looking up people's total levels and whatever. And um... There's one person whose total level is extremely far away from mine, but I really want to try and beat them to the Max Cape, and they are doing a Road to Max Cape series at the moment. I'm not going to say who it is in case they end up watching this video, um, but I do. they do have 2045 total level. Um, and so, yeah, that's just kind of that, you know, that's going to be a pain in the ass to catch up to. But my dungeoneering is already higher than that person. My summoning will be higher than that person once I decide to use all my crimsons. And then once I decide to go and start doing Bork again, I should be able to get my summoning higher than theirs pretty easily. My farming, I should be able to get up above theirs if I ever start doing trees, which I don't think that I'm going to, to be honest. I kind of feel like if I just do herb runs all the way to 99, and then by the time that I get 99 everything else, I'll be almost at 99 farming and have made a lot of money rather than losing a lot of money on farming. And, um, if anybody's wondering what I'm planning on doing as far as the uh, 250k bonus XP item in June, I plan on using that on, um, construction because at the moment, without using, st uh, steel and creation hammers, construction costs about 7 GP per XP, and if I use it all on construction, then I get all almost all the way to level 70, which gets me the Karasi Sword, and, uh, of course, I would need to pay, um, what would it be? It would be, I would need to get 250,000 XP legit, and it's about 7 GP per XP. So it would cost me almost 2 mil to get me up to 70, but you can see right now I have 75k, te 75K tokens. Um, so I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye.